Hello everyone. Today we are going to learn new vocabularies related to church. Here are some Catholic symbols that you will see almost in every Catholic churches throughout the world. And let's start. It's the vessel which holds the precious blood of Christ. That's the chalice. And that's a shallow dish that holds the bread which becomes the body of Christ. It must be gold or gold plated. That's called paten. A golden vessel with a lid that is used for reservation and distribution of host is called the ciborium. The small closing golden vessel used to carry holy sacrament to those who cannot come to the church is called the pyx. The alb is the full length white garment worn by the priest and deacon and that's the alb. The vessels that are used by priests to wash their hands are called the lavabo and pitcher. The white rectangular cloth that is used for wiping the chalice is called the purificator. The rectangular white cloth that covers the altar table for the celebration of Mass is called the altar cloth. A candle often red in color that burns near the tabernacle when the blessed sacrament is present there and that's sanctuary lamp. The incense board usually holds the incense before it is placed in the thurible for burning and that's the incense board. The thurible is used for carrying and burning incense and that's called thurible. The cincture is worn around the alb if it does not fit closely to the body of the priest and that's the cincture. Usually it will be rung three times each for the bread and the wine at the moment of consecration and that's the consecrated bells. Usually, the dress worn by the altar servers is called cassock. The vestment of the Deccan, unlike the chasuble, the dalmatic has sleeves, and that's called dalmatic.
chasuble is worn by the priest over his other vestments. It symbolizes the yoke of Christ and of the priesthood and that's the chasuble. The long stripe of fabric worn around the neck, it matches the color of the day and that's the stole. It used to carry holy water for sprinkling is called aspersorium. Sacred oils like oil of chrism, oil of the sick, oil of the catchments. And sacred oil is also one of the symbols of the church. And that's the sacred oil. The processional cross harkens back to the days of the Roman army when the standard bearer would carry the insignia of particular legend into battle and that's the processional cross. With these 20 symbols let me complete my video. Hope you all enjoyed it. Thank you for watching.